and then um so you can also choose the um the start date and uh, end date for currencies to be available so let me go to the task so again you will go to setup and maintenance and um, check from here if in required uh, uh, required list is available if it's not available go to switch to all tasks then check again okay here it is available manage currencies okay so just click on search you can see all the currencies that are available uh, and enabled by default so if you don't want uh, some of the currencies you can disable them and you can uh, save them so once uh, you enable the currencies that are in use then you go to manage currency profile options uh, define the common okay. define the co common corporate currency so this is the default currency so mostly it will be uh, your primary uh, where your business is doing prime like main location right so so suppose your company is operating from us we will choose us dollars if your com if your company is use using uh, so mostly it will be corporate currency it will be us dollar so it depends again and then common currency rate type it will be corporate so some of this are uh, by default uh, you will see the same values if you want to change uh, from us to some other country then you you might need to review these changes so again um, one more uh, one more thing is uh, we know right uh, every day the currency rates will get changed if you enable multiple uh, currencies uh, we actually need to define the daily rates so if you go to uh, this task manage daily rates uh, below to this you can see rate types that are available and we already choose it corporate as our default type if you go to daily rates uh, you need to choose usd into inr Okay. and uh, if you want to check the daily rate uh, between 13th and 14th you just need to click on search you can see what is the rate uh, at, at this for corporate type so on on 14th march so this is the date uh, this uh, this is the rate and uh, uh, where is another date 13 yeah so this is the rate on 13th it might be same or different uh, so how we will uh, how we will create this rates is so we can use this create in spreadsheet Click on this. Then before this, just make sure uh, you download this tool and install. Download desktop in in integration installer from tools. And uh, once it is available, so you can go to uh, this task and then uh, you download that all and install. Uh, 
okay once it is downloaded right so go to that sheet it is a macro file so you need to provide the uh, instance login details let me log in then just sign in So it will get the template. Okay. So here you you do the from currency and to currency and then conversion rate type corporate from conversion date. This is a date. You will will apply some date. That this needs to be in some format. Let's check. 2020. There is a specific format for this uh, date. Let's see. Suppose conversion rate is something, I'll just enter randomly. Okay. And uh, once you submit, uh, you enter these values. You can enter all the values that are um, going. You are going to uh, update, right? So you will enter all these rows. Once it is completed, you just click on submit. Then it will create. Uh, so this records into the application. Insert failed. I think it is because the uh, date format. Yeah. So we just need to make sure, uh, uh, this date. So I'll, I'll, I'll show you the, the correct date for format. Just, I think it should be in some, um, month and then month hyphen like that so in place of slash when maybe we need to use hyphen uh so so this currencies will be used for opportunities opportunity revenues and in in um and most mostly wherever the currency involves right so we will be using this currencies and in reporting also this currencies can be used it so with this uh, i'm stopping uh, the recording okay uh, hi everyone so today uh, we will see the remaining topics uh, for initial setup uh, so yesterday um uh, in the previous session we covered uh, these topics right uh, until business units so today we will see uh, implementation project accounting calendar currencies and if time